punggung lagi kurang bayar nak. Eh, sure. Ati mana nak tapas ke? Moga mayu nang aping ni mo. Balen si mo. Mana nak tanya? Nah, ni tu dah tunggu balik bolin tu. Mana mau balik bol? Dah umur yang pai pai. Dah okey lah. Ami, mana nak improve? Pai pai. Di sini bronze mas tu sila pagi nanti wig. Oh, kani. Karena gold nasi lah. Ni improve kani. Poblasi ni lah kontra. Tiba ang poblasi ni kau ni tu. Poblasi ni. Mana nak kau nanti? How how are you doing, ladies? Good. Okay. Good as always. Nang. Alak kau unak run di nanti upai nayaan. Saka lah, Jim. Ikaw ba? Hala, nasa ba doon sa mami? Pahinayi da yun. Check one, check one. Check two, check two. Check two, check two. Huwag yun. Yeah, okay, folks. Ano? I want to welcome y'all to today's show. Check two, check two. And this is going to be some marketing research. With these three beautiful Philippines here. Let we'll me make sure everybody's in frame before we get too far into it. Uh, it appear to be, for the most part, in frame, except for Flo's feet. Hmm? So if anybody wants to see her feet, too bad. They're hanging <laughs> off the end of the... So, anyhow, I'm going to do some marketing research. You know, every day, the joy about... The joy in creating these shows is that the sky is truly the limit. I have no niche here on this <laughs> platform, this channel. And so when certain things pop into my head, I just set the camera up and tell the ladies to be ready. So ladies, today you are part of a market research program to determine which products you like, you love, maybe you dislike. If it's food, we need to taste it. <laughs> I agree. Taste first. <laughs> I agree. But part of what I'm doing is to decide what I'm going to order you ladies. I don't want to order stuff that you're totally not interested in and just waste the shipping and the cost, right? So I'm trying to figure out what you like based on the visuals. We'll order that, do taste tests, and then we'll go from there. But, you know, big companies pay millions of dollars for this type of market research. And today's products are going to be seafood. Okay, like canned, tinned mm -hmm. seafood. But very quality, high quality seafood. Salmon from Alaska. Sardines from Spain. And so all I'm going to do is show you some pictures, show you some products, and I just want you to choose which one you like, which one uh, you would go for. And folks, nothing scripted here. we got two children uh, that just came back from school. They're fired up. They're playing. The audio is never clean, so to speak, here on my show. Uh, so deal with it. It's real life. Now, what qualifies? Let's talk about what... Ladies, ready to listen in English? Okay, because there's going to be... Let's go ahead and get that particular noisemaker from, from the... Give that to mommy, babe. Forcey, give that to mommy. That's, that's just destroying the audio. Thank you. Okay, great. Now he's going to go in there and make noise in the room. Mother of the year. Ayo, 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 labay naga, tagoe. He's wearing a Spider-Man uniform. Okay. All right, ready to listen in English? Okay, what qualifies you ladies uh, to be experts on seafood? Okay, now we already have a big booty violation. I lifted up. I had a hoo-ha violation, and I, I gave these ladies. I gave these ladies a briefing. Uh, Flo, hoo-ha violation. Come on. No, I'm I'm wearing pads. Pads. 
Pants. Pads. Pants. That's a very funny show. We don't need to know that. That's okay. Mm. <laughs> 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 Can you spot it one? Ladies. Maybe that you on? Let's get back to the market research at hand. Okay. okay. We were right there. All right. What makes you experts on seafood? That's a question. Huh? <laughs> I can ding 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 ding. What makes you expert in seafoods? Yeah. What? What do you mean? You explain. What? What, what do you mean? mean? Okay. We're expert. Uh, do you ladies? Just eating. I can. Okay, there you go, right? <laughs> expert in eating. <laughs> These ladies are experts in eating. Yeah. We're not expert in touching, just touching. Eating! Yeah. Because you will know what quality is that if you eat. That's it. Because okay, you've Mama lived in the Philippines your whole life, right? Yeah. You've lived, like right now, we're one kilometer from the beach, from the water, from the sea. Yeah. And what is your favorite food? Is it pork, chicken, or seafood? Seafood. <laughs> oh my God. I don't like chicken. Uh, uh, we we used to eat chicken, pork, but some it's more favorite or we we, we don't always eat seafood. That's why seafood is my favorite. Okay. So folks, you got three Filipinos here that basically love to eat seafood. Yes. Any type of seafood. They love to eat sardines. But they beans. don't really like crabs. Oh my god, I love crabs. Okay, so one loves crabs, one doesn't like crabs. But they love to eat seafood. Any type of seafood. And they love to eat. Well, let me ask you do you ladies love to eat sardines? Yeah. That's what the kanangkan and sana kanang survive survive foods <laughs> survival foods. <laughs> okay, this is what I this is what I suspect. Okay, Fatima doesn't love sardines like she used to because she's been living with the foreign guy. I love to eat I love to eat the sardines because I don't have choice now. <laughs> yeah, so after seven years. If you years, put sardines with toyo and sili, wow. Yeah, uh, with salt. No, no. Okay, so they do love to eat sardines. Mabuak na ha. One time, well, Ay, mabuak. several times I've taken Fatima fishing and I, I brought some sardines for bait. Uy. And she and her sidekick Marissa and Maria, they ate my bait. <laughs> Remember that? I had sardines and bread for bait. Oh, they basically made oh. sardine sandwiches. Yeah, I still remember. Okay, so they're they're experts on eating uh, Ay, sardines. Right? Okay, so ladies, I'm gonna inter I'm gonna turn your attention, folks. I got the big screen here with oh. these graphics on here. I'll put the graphics on the screen. Maybe. I'll put the graphics on the screen. <laughs> Scratching of the hoo-ha violation. No, I my legs. There's a yellow pillow right over there. She needs to conceal too much uh, chubbiness. Okay. Okay. Ladies, I'm trying to. Okay, number one, the bear's ass is going to scratch the microphone. Okay, you're screwing up the audio with the. Now you're messing up the audio with the bear's head. How many how many years we've been doing this, ladies? Okay, there you go. Pay attention to the microphone. Okay. We're ready to see the what we eat. Are, what we, we, are we ready to continue? Yes. I mean, I think we're 20 minutes into the show and we haven't even got the first test out of the way. Yeah, yeah. Because you, you, you keep talking, talking in there. Okay, everybody ready? All right, no. anyhow, this is uh, Patagonia Provisions. They, it, what you don't know is Patagonia is involved in selling uh, food. And I'm going to talk about 
why they're sort of interesting to me. There, there were and are involved in selling beer, uh, which it's is pretty cool. Here, but <laughs> let's go to the first market research. And I'm showing the sardines ladies. Sardines in olive oil. On the left, we've got sardines in olive oil. And then you've got sardines and coconut curry sauce. And I'm not going to tell you too much more information. This, these sardines are from the northern coast of Spain. I like this, I like this olive oil. Okay, so Fatima, you were, you're going for the olive oil. And what about you two ladies? Sardines in coconut curry sauce. In the coconut curry sauce. Yeah. Right. Because it's, it's like chicken curry. <laughs> Because there is curry. <laughs> so th does that does that look absolutely delicious? Yeah. It tastes a because you know. It's, it's there is a colorful. <laughs> it's coconut curry uh. sauce. So you like the coconut curry sauce. Now, Fatima, you like coconut curry, right? Yeah. But you prefer the sardines and the olive it's oil. It's just no. It's just plain. It's healthy. It's healthy. It's because coconut, coconut, coconut is healthy. Coconut is like <laughs> Healthy. Healthy. <laughs> then they have, ano, they have potato. Mm -hmm. See, it's healthy. I think they, they, there is a kind that's chili or not. Okay, so let me ask this question. Would you prefer to get a can of sardines from Prince, some local sardines, or do you prefer these sardines from the northern I coast think. of Spain? This one. These right here? Yeah, but this is expensive. That's expensive. Dollar? Well, it's eight, eight, it's eight fifty US dollars. per fifty one dollar. So that's no, almost not eight. Adiba, if one dollar fifty pesos, so that's eight dollar. That's almost a lot. Eighteen, eight. nineteen, twenty eight, plus 20, nine, eighteen 25. for the cheap one. Eighteen cheap. Awesome. Okay, so, so round that up to twenty pesos. That would 22. be twenty two. Say forty. Ninda tilahang is that no directoloy? Forty US cents. <laughs> that's tuna. Or not? That's why it's uh, no expensive because it's not Ladies, toloy. That's sardines. <laughs> sardines toloy, lagi na. That's totally different than tuna. Mm. You're supposed to be seafood Is that expert. no toloy? That's toloy, right? No, that's tuna. Tuna sardines. Ladies. The fish ba? It's tuna, right? Okay, no tuna. You've seen the tuna, like the yellowfin tuna. Tini lagi sardines. No, that's not, that's kan toloy. Toloy lagi na. Okay, can, can we get Spider-Man off the back of there before he Wait, falls off and bust, down. bust his head? Down. Come on down there, Spider-Man. Down, down. Okay. Down. Sit down. Uh, actually, my experts, um, almost a booty violation there, paid 20 pesos extra. Pobre, sit down. Pobre. Na yung... Let, let's get back to the market research here. My squad of single moms here. All right, no, sardines are not the same as tuna. My, my seafood experts, that's sardines. Sardines. All right, so the let's... To, the toloy, like the toloy. The one we the buy in the market. Uh -huh. That's not the same. That's it's different. Big. Yeah, well, sardines from other places in the world, in, most fish from other places in the world are much bigger than the fish but that we're used to here. But the same here in can four pieces only. <laughs> yeah, but those, those fish, are five pieces. Five months. <laughs> Okay, so yes, there is a price disparity. A can of cheap sardines here is say 50 US cents versus $8. So you could have 16 cans of local sardines uh, versus that, admittedly. All right, folks, and we keep getting interrupted because we got two small children uh, and things happen and it's noisy. All right, enough, enough of this. I don't even know where we were at, but basically I got two votes for the coconut curry, one vote for the sardines olive, oil, olive oil, and a discussion about the price disparity. But listen, when it comes to food or anything in life, you get what you pay for, okay? Now we've got some of this stuff inbound, and I know that once you ladies sink your teeth into those sardines and coconut curry, you're not gonna be worried about the price because this is delicious. And the stuff that we get here is survival. There's a huge difference, right? Well, I'm just saying it like it is, right? It ain't gonna win no awards, but yeah, it'll, it'll uh, keep you alive. It's a different stuff here.
Now, ladies, on the left, we have a mussels <coughs> variety pack. You, you know what those mussels are, right? We got smoked mm -hmm. mussels, spicy mussels, and lemon herb mussels in extra virgin Hi. olive oil broth. It's a three pack on the left. And on the right, we have a variety pack of sardines. So if you had to choose the two pack of sardines or the three pack of mussels, which one would you choose? No, mussels variety, three pack. That's the spicy. Okay, so you, you would go with the mussels, Fatima? Yeah, it's delicious too. Okay, so two votes. Fatima, you didn't vote? I'm going to the sardines. You're, you're sticking to the sardines. Can you tell us why? I'm not a fan of lemon. I'm not a fan of spicy. And I'm not a fan of... What? What is that? That's not an fish, right? That's... Okay, so... I'm not a fan of eating like that. Would I must just, prefer the sardines in coconut curry, the side, sardines variety yeah, pack. That's okay, so everybody's taking the two cans of sardines versus the mussels. Yeah. No. I'll explain, Fatima told me earlier, she doesn't like smoked, she doesn't like spicy, this is her preference, and she doesn't like lemon. Now for me, I love smoked, spicy, and lemon. And spicy, I like spicy. Spicy is delicious too. Okay, so both of you ladies like spicy. Do you like lemon? No. Do you like smoked? And that's something I've, I've learned about Filipinas here. Um, when I smoked that meat for like four, six, eight hours, they weren't into it. And they're not Thai girls, they're not into spicy, most of them. But you've just heard these ladies' uh, personal preferences. So there you go, moving right along. Now we've got lemon caper mackerel versus lemon olive Spanish white anchovies. It's the same price point, but they're two different fishes. Okay? So you, you're, you're stuck with the lemon, but which do you go with? You go with the mackerel or you go with the, the mackerel? Got one vote for the mackerel. What lemon about you, other two mackerel. And Flo, yeah, the I'm bear's head the scratching the audio. There you go. There we go. Mackerel. 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 Yeah. So three votes for the mackerel. They're not. They don't want the anchovies. Anchovies. No. What's that? A little small. The small gonna circle? Dilis. Is that the Dilis? Mm -hmm. The problem is that's the biggest Dilis you've ever seen, right? <laughs> yeah. 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 Ye
Huh? The wild pink salmon. Okay, so the wild pink salmon. <laughs> because the Spanish paprika macaroni is like too spicy. Okay, well the, 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 the exercise is to pick one. So if you could pick two, you would. But I'm just asking for one, your top pick. Wild pink salmon, black wild pink, wild pink Okay, it's salmon. a wild pink salmon. Now, Ladies, let's That's move on up in fish. price point here. We're, we're <laughs> roughly around the 5,000 pesos price point. Now, we have this responsible seafood sampler. And seafood you get the wild pink salmon, the sockeye salmon. But I'm just going to, I'm not even going to focus on that. I'm going to focus on one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ten small boxes, two big boxes, and a drink tumbler versus uh, 10 small boxes, two big boxes, versus four, let's see, 10 small boxes and a book, okay? That's a recipe? Yeah, it's a- Recipe book? Yeah, it looks like a recipe book for 10 enthusiasts and fish- Oh uh, yeah, it's a recipe. Fishinados, yeah, so it's a, a recipe book for the, the 10 fish. So you don't, do you want, the, the one that comes with the free tumbler, uh, the one that just has the straight with up free fish, book. it's two dollars cheaper, or the one with the free book and less. With free book. Who wants the book? Me. Okay, you're the only one in college and you went for the free book. Yeah. What about you, Fatima? I'm going to the... Free tumbler. The free tumbler. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm not good. <laughs> I'm fond of reading. <laughs> okay. I can cook without that. Wow, <laughs> So you have no interest in reading a book? No. I'm fond of reading recipes. Okay. Yeah. Uh, too much violation. Pay 20 extra pesos. <laughs> Which one do you want? <laughs> the book? Uh. Okay, well, that's interesting. I figured none of y'all would pick the book because you can't eat the book, but okay. All right, so two for the book and one for the tumbler. So, at least, let me go and I buy one too. I know how to cook without that. <laughs> okay, now, uh, you got to follow me here. Don't worry about the muscles on the right. Just these two here because they're about the same price point. One's 86, one's 85, same thing. So do you want three, six, nine, 12 things of fish? Or do you want three fish, two noodles, two crackers, and this canvas tote there? Which the one's more one? appealing to the Filipino? The first one, that's a lot. <laughs> okay, Miljean, which one? This one or the one with the free bag? Zero rating for that. <laughs> okay, so everybody wants the food. <laughs> Do you ladies like this tote? Is it yeah. nice or you don't? Yeah, but, yeah, like it, but, but we cannot eat that one. Okay, so they like the tote, but you can't eat it. So you go with the more <laughs> fish. Here we go. White anchovies, variety packed on the Did list. It? Versus uh, mackerel, same price. Versus sardines, you save a couple bucks. I'm going to the mackerel. Mackerel, yeah. Okay, five miles on the mackerel. Float. It's a... <laughs> the mackerel. Mackerel, what about you, Calamansi? Mackerel, too. Okay, the because mackerel. That's already three pack. Mm. Um, With pack. Spanish paprika, the spicy one, but roasted garlic and lemon cup. I'm not fan of that, but I'm not the only one to eat. Okay, so you're thinking about others. That's a lot already. Yeah, and also, I... The, no, so small, the white. No, so small. Those this anchovies are small fish. Okay. All right, moving right along. Now, here we go. The wild sockeye salmon, lightly smoked, versus the black pepper pink salmon. Uh, let's just do those two, because there's the same price point. Number two, wild pink salmon. You like the black pepper. What about you, Flo? Number three. Number, I said leave number two. Oh, that's a different price point. Number two. Number two, the wild pink salmon. Smoke, I don't like the picking Filipinos smoke. Don't, don't like the smoke. <laughs> that's that's a lot of time. <laughs> number, number two. 
Okay, now if you had to choose out of all three, forget the price points. Don't worry about the price. Which one would you pick? Number three. You stick? I stick the wild pink salmon. All right, so two for the sardines, one on the pink salmon. Man, these ladies are unpredictable. <laughs> Here we go. The spicy mussels versus the lemon, olive, spinach, Whoa. white anchovies versus the smoked mackerel. Which one? Number two. Number one. Number one. Flo? Number two. Number two. Number two. There you have it. Okay. Had to get Spider Man off the back of the couch. They, what they lemon caper mackerel. Smoked mussels or lemon herb mussels? Which one? I like the one. I like the second one. Smoke mussels. Smoke mussels. Oh. Because the one with the pearls. Calamansi. No process. Number three. Lemon herb mussels. Okay, I'm not fan so of lemon. So it seems to be a trend. You ladies aren't fan, a fan of anything lemon, right? Because I've tried to make lemon, butter, too garlic sour. stuff. It's too like sour. Lemon. You like more of a salt thing. The second is better. The second Even is better. it's smoked yeah, mussels, the but the the presentation, oh, look, oh. I like the number. The three. rating is too. It's too. It's too high. Two six three. Okay, looks like more people have purchased the smoked oh. mussels and left the review. Moving right along. Oh. Roasted garlic, Spanish white oh. anchovies. Roasted garlic or Spanish paprika? Number two. Number three. Number three. Yes. Number two. Number Spanish two. paprika mussels. Number two. Number two. I love garlic. You like the garlic? Yeah. All right. And it's roasted. Okay, moving right along. New fish. <laughs> Who wants to buy this book for $22? Anybody interested? We don't have money like that. <laughs> would you rather have... Uh, I'm, I'm not buying it because... <laughs> would you rather have two sardines or this book? Two sardines? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, nobody interested in the, in the book. But you, but you would like the free cookbook. Cookbook, okay, but books about... Uh, it's just all up. I, I, that's all about the fish. I fish. just asked that. Market. What's that fish? What fish is that? <laughs> okay, so no need for a fish reference or history book. All right, now we have some pasta ladies. Now, all I want you to focus on is do you like this type of pasta, the shells, or the, uh, the first I call one. twists? Me too, the first. I like the first one. Everybody like the first one? Yeah, but yeah. Forrest G likes it that. Me and Forrest G, we like the twists. Okay, there you go. There you have it. Mm. Which crackers? Garlic, garlic, garlic. The cheddar or the garlic? Garlic. I like that first one. I don't like cheese. Garlic yeah. is delicious. Okay, so the Filipinos aren't big into cheese because they don't eat cheese here. But the same ratings, huh? So you're looking at the ratings. Yeah. <laughs> okay, but you like the garlic. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Now, it's foreign delicious. guy, I like garlic. The smell and the of cheese. rosemary. That's nice. Okay. There you go, folks. If you're going to sell the Filipinas, uh, they're not too big of the cheese. It's just not something they're... Yeah. Well, number two. Okay, you want the We're coffee cup, the tumbler, cup. or the number food two. storage container? That's number two. two. Number two. Number two. Okay, everybody wants the because tumbler. Because it's blue. Okay. Because it's tumbler. <laughs> it's a tumbler. All right, now here's sort of the same question. Number one. Number two. <laughs> I keep on stick to one. <laughs> uh, Fatima, I'm trying to keep this a family-friendly show. But could you say that again? What did you say? I don't give a damn. You don't give a peep about that book. Yeah. Okay, so moving right along. Okay, if you had a choice, if somebody was going to send you a gift, would you A, just, just send me a gift card, and then you go online and you can buy whatever you want. Or would you want these muscles to show up in the mail? Or would you want that book to show up in the mail? Number one. Number two. Number one. Number one. Okay, Number so, two. Uh, if you get a gift certificate, you have to go online and order and you have to wait maybe another week to get mm. your product, right? So at you least I at least I I buy what I want. What you want. But yeah. you, you want the muscles right then so you can eat right away. Mm. Yeah? Okay. 
Uh, I thought you you like a book. You like to read. There's no book in that. There's no a book. book. No book over there. I don't like the. No, kana. <laughs> Oh, you want the cake book. I want the recipe book, not the... <laughs> not the history book or the <laughs> species book. Yes, okay. I should. <laughs> History book is nice, but I like that. Well, I mean, this is, this is a lesson in, mar in the market research. I, I think the lesson is if you're selling food, it makes sense to sell recipe books. Perfect sense, right? Yeah. But don't try to pair a book about... Uh, yeah, about saving the salmon. Yeah, the right? truth about farm salmon and the consequence you can no longer ignore. Because it has nothing to do with cooking. Yeah. Okay, so there you go. The ladies are interested in the cookbook. They're not interested I'm in not the activism book. It. It's an activism book, right? That's so free. Okay, uh, folks, here's a, you can subscribe to this and save 10%. So I just asked the ladies, I said, hey, if you could get the same box of fish every month, what would you want? If, and you can change it, but if you if you thought oh, I'm gonna get the same same thing every month out of all these products you've seen, what would be the most perfect product for you that every month you knew you were gonna get a can of what? The sardines, the salmon, the mussels. The sardine and the salmon. You can pick one. Salmon. Sardine. The, so, the, the one that so too, with coconut curry. So the coconut curry sardines. Yeah. Every month you could taste that, you would masara. Yeah. Salamasi. <laughs> you said you can you can <laughs> change. <laughs> for now, for this one. Salmon, uh, sardine. Next one, salmon. With roast, uh, roasted garlic, what are they? So yeah. you would change it up every month. Yeah. Yeah, you can do Mus that. Uh, mussels and then. Mussels? Mussels. Mussels. Like Here's my mussels. Mussels. <laughs> I like the mussels too. Mussels, the spicy. Mussels, and I know the spicy one and lemon. the salmon. Me, I uh, stick to sardines. <laughs> well, sticking to what she knows. One of the sardines. One of sardines. <laughs> Baka naman sardines. Baka naman. I'm just here waiting for you. Sardine. <laughs> okay, folks. All right, ladies. That. Let me just say a couple words. What's interesting about these folks, they're somehow associated with brewing beer. I don't know if you used to be able to buy beer on here. I don't see where you can buy the beer now. But there's the places you can get it on the map there in the tavern. Uh, white beer. White beer. And obviously, the Patagonia brand is big on uh, I'm not activism. Fun of beer. Uh, Fatima, you're leaning forward, which means you're way out of frame. And also, uh, Flo, you're picking the dead ends <laughs> off of your hair and probably messing up the audio. No, man. Hi. I'm great. Okay. <laughs> Go. Are you excited about taste testing these products? Yeah. Yeah? Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> I'm excited. I'm excited. Yes, oi. Taste this. My God. Oh, the coconut, the coconut carry. I will be present. Just call me. Oh, uh, take it here. Oh. No, 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 no. I'm not asking you to come here. <laughs> so if the box shows up, are you ladies going to call Flo to tell her to come over or are you just going to start eating? I'm, we're going to start eating and then call her to Flo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're here. I thought you were in there. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Uh, we're going to call her to Flo. <laughs> as long as you... Uh, run ba? So what, Flo? What if there's only one can of coconut curry sardines, and the la and these two ladies eat everything before you get over here? Would you be upset? No. Uh, no. To be honest. <laughs> no, guy. No. I will not be angry as long as there's still a salmon. <laughs> because it, 
if I order it by air, it takes you know it, it takes me about ten days to get a product here from the U.S. Right. Mm -hmm. So if they eat all the stuff before you get here, it would it would at least take ten more days before you could get a taste. Just don't eat a lot. Just don't eat all. Just let me even one. Yeah, put, put, it put it in the ref. <laughs> because I will go here as soon as possible. <laughs> So once you're notified that the coconut curry sardines have arrived, how long do you think it would take you to get here? Would you wait for John John to give you a ride or would you just start walking? No, I will not walk. <laughs> but if you, if, if, if you don't walk, the ladies might eat everything before you arrive. That's okay, as long as there's still a rice. <laughs> I have class next week, but yeah. What does class have to do with <laughs> taste testing seafood from Spain? No. I don't care if they eat it all. Just order again. <laughs> <laughs> well, ladies, she doesn't seem too interested in participating in my taste test. No, I am interested, as always. Maybe I'm there, interested in okay, okay. There'll be two two taste testers, and you can eat more if, if Flo doesn't come over. No. I was here when we are doing the okay, okay. I will be here if it's eating, not just okay, okay. Because eating is my life. <laughs> oh my God. No, there's somebody out front hollering. That's not a goat. That's not a good. No, that's a kuya. So somebody respond. See what the kuya wants. Hola, man. He's already gone. He's not there. I think that's the the meat is there. Oh, the goat. It sounded like the goat said, "Too big, too big." <laughs> Yeah. I'm holding it down. Ladies, thank you very much for participating in my less than exciting market research video here. Because to be honest, I, I don't. I, I mean, I think I know the, the the coconut curry sardines is a big hit, right? Mm -hmm. And the mackerel and the mussels. Yeah. I love to try the the, gar the garlic one, the roasted garlic. Mm -hmm. But five miles down with that lemon, with that pepper pink salmon too. Is that delicious? Let me try. Salmon, salmon, I said, can I? Salmon, can I? Chicken, can I? Can I? Okay, ladies, thank you very much for your participation. And yeah, there's so many hoo-ha violations on you. You, you owe me about about 1,500 pesos. No, that was a double piece. 1,500 pesos or 1,000 pesos. You got Daisy Dukes on, and then that pillow is making like straight, and then there's a clear shot from the camera. <laughs> I'm trying to run a family-friendly oh. show here. I know. Boo boo. Okay, thank you, ladies. Thank you, thank you, ladies, for your lack of or your cooperation. We go sing na. Pantagan na ko ni. Oi, Marcos, we going to do a Paris with ya, Marcos. Ferris wheel. I biking. Biking and Ferris wheel. Ta, I don't like Ferris wheel. Eh. What's the matter with Ferris wheel? Katawan tungo yung tigwa. Oh, tigwa. Oh, oh, oh. Hina hina. Bangga na. Hina hina. Hindi nung kaya yun pero mas gusto ko ang biking. Ang biking yun nung kaya yun. Ano magin nung kaya? Oh, tigwa Ferris wheel. The one that in the ano? With the circle one ba yun? Ano? Kano na siya? Patuyok. Patuyok ang Viking kay katamot ng bambot. Mall of Asia has Mall of a big Asia Ferris wheel. Mm. The thing that's round that goes like. Ito, too slow, Ramana. That too slow. Oh, 
ti. Ko sa una. Diwa ko sugoy. Taka ka man ang ang kusog ang biking. Ang ang, ang biking, biking pahinay pa na pahinay. Ang biking pa kusgan. Ang biking siya kay wa man siya gud ali. Munang hadlo gud kay siya mo tinaay mo habon na nato mo bung na kay. Feel na ko ba? Basig magsukar ko ba? Nagana o. Ingon sila piya ba man kay dagtan yung biking. Sila madi. Ba iti maning supiya gahapon. Muding mang na sila sa kuan yan ingon pa taon ko ko kalimot ko birthday din ingon pa ko ay edi ko la init unya birthday din supiya baka kolera na kog batasan Jen nut ko mer wala na de wa no too much body violation one place was fine extra to me kon yo ni libreta to supiya na ko asa man dai sin ko asa man dai mo mo to slung sud ina na kala Sing, sing. Go ahead. Sing, sing, sing. Start singing. Yeah, okay, Nadeka. Go ahead. Okay, Nadeka. Go ahead, bust it out. Let me hear some Whitney Houston. So you're okay now. We go sing. You're the inspiration. Go ahead, right here. Go ahead. Your inspiration. No, listen. I, what I want y'all to do right now, for before we conclude the video, is sing. And I, 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 No, because that he will say that that will be mad. <laughs> because you sing. Yeah. So John John doesn't like it when you sing. Yeah. And dancing, because I'm a dancer. I'm sorry. I'm a good singer and I'm a good well, dancer. The problem is you ladies are so loud when you sing. At least I'm. I, we're not loud in the evening. <laughs> All right, let me, let me hear you one more time. Let me hear the music. La musica. Let me hear it loud. Let me hear it More, more Whitney Houston. I got that, Jen. Let's go. I don't even know what the songs of Whitney, Whitney Houston. The same one you just singing. The Hit it again. One more time. More cowbell. It's right here. <laughs> All right, Calamari. You know that song, You're the Inspiration? Go ahead. You're the Inspiration. You give me meaning in my life. You give me meaning in my life. You're the inspiration. Muram ka kata yan aja. When you love somebody. When you love somebody. Go ahead, Fatima. Your turn. Na. Ayo, sana ingat nak aku anak. Aku nak ingat anak. Thank you very much. Goodbye everyone. Don't forget to subscribe. Click the notification. Click the notification. See you in our next video. I love you. I love you guys. Ay, sige, anak lagi kay malatag sa mga. Ay, folks, you see the stress I'm under here. Thank you, buddy. You see the stress I'm under? Just trying to do a little market research on 
what sardines they like the most. You know, what, which one they want me to order. It's stressful. It's stressful trying to get anything out of these ladies. So I just thought I'd let the camera run, let you feel some of my pain. If you're interested in any of the products we just featured, links down in the description. Go ahead and buy your Filipina some of that and see if she likes it. Guarantee she will. Maybe not the lemon. We're just not down with that lemon flavor. Foreign guy is. I love the lemon. All right, folks. Until tomorrow. We'll see y'all tomorrow. But I'm like, I'm so stressed out right now. Like, all the energy was just zapped out of me. And now they want to turn on Whitney Houston for real and do good jokey, good karaoke in my living room. I, I don't know why I stopped drinking. I really don't. If I was sitting here with a cold beer, I can listen to some more Whitney Houston, but I can't, I can't take no more. Anyhow, I'm out of here. Appreciate y'all joining us on today's show. Hope you have a wonderful evening. And peace out. They're getting ready to sing. My gosh, I gotta go.